Hey there YouTube, Flaming Creations here, back with another video, and today I have this Part 5 Spoon Glove for Matt. So, uh, the Flaming Creations Holiday Sale went a lot better this year than it did last year in 2022, and I actually have uh, more than one order this year, so you can expect uh, quite a few more videos from me. Uh, also an update on the in-stock gloves. Uh, all of the in-stock gloves have sold aside from the plastic bladed underwater versus glove. That is the last remaining in-stock glove we have and will be until that sells or until I get the orders done. But um, Matt was the first order up on the block. Um, also, if I say, I should say that if this uh, glove looks all funky on my hand, that this is on an XL leather. Um, Matt requested it be on an XL leather, so. You got the free range movement of the ring and pinky fingers, and then the spoon fingers being the middle and index moved together. So, get a good look at the solder spills on this. One thing I'm not sure if a lot of people are aware of, but, um, the spoon glove armature, at least the one that we have pictures of, because of this glove here that I'm replicating, is not actually the spoon glove seen in the film. And that's just due to the fact that we don't really have pictures of what the spoon glove seen in the film look like. Aside from a few small glimpses and the fact that the pinky on the current spoon glove that we do have pictures of does not match up. But spoon glove nonetheless. Plus the one in the film had like bendy blades and other stuff. Also, I apologize uh, for the wind. I'm trying to record these videos outside until I can no longer do that, so. Oh, I remember what I was going to say. But uh, the spoon glove that we have photos of uh, is pretty similar to the supposed Part 5 secondary hero. The solder spills on the fingers are almost identical, but they are different. Uh, a few examples I can give is on the secondary hero, all of these little solder spills here are connected, and there's a line coming up where here it's more so like you have a dot, and then you have another dot there where it'd be like a line, but it's just dots. Um, on this one, this little edge there comes out a little bit more. Uh, another thing, too... The difference wise between the secondary hero and the spoon glove is on the uh, secondary hero uh, right here the corner of the ring finger is a little rounded where on the spoon glove it is at a sharp angle so if we get a look at the spoon glove I did or the actual spoon now I don't know how well the color is showing up on here uh, I'm recording this outside so it's overcast. Let's see. Maybe flash turn on help? I have absolutely no idea other than it is cold. But I added a few different colors. Uh, you got your main base coat of a uh, orangeyish brown. There's some darker browns in there. Uh, some greens to replicate mold. And then some red for blood. So like to have an assortment of grunginess on the spoon glove so or on the spoon so open up bitch <laughs> uh aside from that though um yeah this is the spoon glove for matt um one last thing i should say is that uh if you're looking to uh, order a glove uh orders are now currently open uh, the sale's over, so glove prices have returned back to normal, but, um, I am currently accepting orders probably until next, probably, like, next August or September, I'd think. Um, oh, I should also say that the copper, if it looks light right now, it should weather up with time. It's more of a time thing. Uh, but yeah, uh, hope you enjoy your spoon glove, Matt. Again, it's on XL leather, so... Anyways, uh, thank you everybody for watching. Please remember to like and subscribe to the channel. And I will see you guys all next time.